To see how a cell repairs a double strand break using DNA homology dependent double strand break repair, let's imagine that we have a parental DNA duplex containing the sequence A, B, C, D, E. We then imagine that the duplex is broken by a double strand break in the C region. To begin the repair process, double strand breaks in the DNA first undergo nuclease degradation to yield duplexes with three prime ended single stranded tails. These tails may be hundreds of base pairs long. In a process mediated by recombination proteins, one of the single-stranded three-prime ended tails from the broken parental duplex shown in grey interacts with a homologous duplex shown in pink, such that the grey single strand invades the pink duplex at a region of homology and forms a region of heteroduplex containing the invading grey single strand and the complementary strand from the pink duplex. The displaced pink strand, which is of the same polarity as the invading grey strand, forms a loop. This loop structure, together with the invading strand, is called a displacement loop, or D-loop. The three prime end of the invading strand then acts as a primer for DNA synthesis. The complementary duplex strand serves as the template. However, this D-loop replication does not form an extended region of heteroduplex between the newly synthesized green strand and the template pink strand. Rather, a small bubble containing the template, a short region of the newly synthesized DNA, and the displaced strand forms, and tracks across the pink template strand. This DNA synthesis bubble translocates across the pink template strand until new DNA complementary to the other side of the double strand break in the grey duplex is synthesized. The replication bubble dissociates and the newly synthesized strand, shown here in green, is then captured by the three prime single stranded tail from the other side of the break in the duplex. This capture forms heteroduplex DNA containing the newly synthesized strand, shown in green, and the strand from the broken duplex, shown in grey. The newly captured 3' prime hydroxy end of the broken duplex then serves as a primer for new DNA replication across the break and extending to the other side of the break. Remaining gaps are then filled by replication and ligation. Note that overall, the gap at a double strand break where degradation occurred, the C region, has been repaired by new DNA synthesis, the template for which was a duplex homologous to the broken DNA. We see how a DNA double strand break can be repaired with a more imprecise join in another video, how to repair a double strand break in DNA by non-homologous end joining.